Welcome to Tech Photo Blog. This is episode number five. This week I'm going to talk about high speed sync between the camera and the flash. Before I get into that high speed sync mode, I want to explain how the camera and the flash uh, traditionally uh, work together to take a photo. Uh, normally the shutter needs to be completely open when you're taking a picture or the whole scene won't get lit because that flash is an instantaneous light source. So if the shutter was only halfway open, half of the scene would be lit and, and the half of the scene that didn't have the shutter open would, would just turn out black. So um, what has to, what normally limits the shutter speed with your flash um, to something like 1 250th of a second or a little more or a little less is the duration of time it takes to open the flash. And my, my Canon 30D on a previous episode I measured that to be about 4 milliseconds. Now that Canon 30D also has a maximum uh, shutter speed of 1 250th of a second which is 4 milliseconds uh, when using the mode when using the flash in non high speed mode. And that's where the 1 250th of a second shutter speed comes when using your flash. But then on modern cameras you can switch them into this high speed mode um, which will let you go really fast like 1 8,000th of a second is how fast I can take uh, a picture with my Canon 30D when I have it set to this mode. So, so how's that working? Because right, the, the, the shutter can't be all the way open uh, because we measured that mechanically it takes 4 milliseconds um, for the shutter to open all the way. To understand this you need to understand how shutters work on modern cameras. There's this first curtain on the shutter and a second curtain on the camera. And, and what's actually happening inside the shutter is are these both move at the same time and you can kind of get this like narrow band of shutter that's open and, and that's how it can get this really fast shutter speed because it's sort of exposing um, just a slice of the, the image and it sort of progresses over the whole image that way. And so, so that wouldn't normally work with a flash, right? Because you have this narrow part of the scene visible, um, but the flash is sort of this instantaneous light source. And you'll, you just get like, you know, one little band of it lit and then the rest of the uh, image would not be lit. It would all be black. So, so what the flash does in these TTL modes or the Canon equivalent for that is it'll um, actually strobe the flash thousands and thousands of times per second. And, and what that does is that sort of takes each one of these slices and, and lights each slice individually. And that's how this high speed sync works. It's actually not a single flash burst, it's thousands of these flash bursts um, sort of combining this, this slicing uh, that the shutter does of the image together. And then you can light the entire scene. So that's basically how it works, right? It's this strobing of the flash, and you've got these two curtains on the flash, and you know, as the strobe flashes, each one of those little slices gets um, lit from the flash, from from different strobes of the flash. Thanks for watching.